ask yourself, what fresh start do I want? What do I want to draw a line in the sand with and enter a new chapter? Meditate on these questions and write down. So what do I want a fresh start on? What old patterns do I want to leave behind and do I not want to bring forwards into this new chapter? And some patterns might be obvious. Sometimes you might think, oh, I want to let go of the pattern of procrastination or I want to let go of the pattern of um, worrying about what other people think about me or I want to let go of the pattern of not managing my money well. I want to let go of the pattern of binge eating or binge drinking. I want to let go of the pattern of uh, toxic relationships. Some of them are very obvious, but you might also have some less obvious ones. And when I say less obvious, it's like we're not aware of them, but they're still controlling our life. So have a look at those as well. What pattern in your life are you becoming more aware of even right now in this moment? Is there a blockage that you might not be able to kind of put your finger on, but you know that there's something holding you back somewhere in some area of your life? Maybe it's in business, maybe it's in personal life, maybe a combination of the two, maybe it's your health, your confidence, your consistency posting on social media, your consistency inviting people to something. Is there a blockage? And if you could feel, if just think about what it is, that thing that might be a pattern that you want to let go of, something that's holding you back, something where you just keep feeling like you're hitting the same wall. I know it's not nice to think about, but just focus on it for a couple of moments and we're going to clear it, okay? So just bring it to the front of your mind, just feel it in your body. And Go inwards, like don't worry about looking at me right now, okay? Just close your eyes if you want to. Focus on that thing, that blockage, that wall that you keep coming up against. And notice where do you feel that energy or that emotion? Where is it living in or around your body? You might feel it in a particular part of your body. You might feel it in a particular muscle or organ. You might even feel it kind of in your aura space because sometimes these things are a little bit around us as well. There's no right or wrong, just notice where it is. Okay, now what we're gonna do is we're gonna start taking some deep breaths, connect through the crown of your head to the most positive bright white light that's pouring in through your head from the universe right now. In fact, keep taking these breaths, keep picturing connecting to that light. Feel your own, feel your body or feel your energy actually starting to rise up like you're just growing a bit taller. Maybe your energy is actually climbing above your head and it's reaching out up into the universe. So you and the universe, you're connecting and you're drawing this energy, this light through the crown of your head. It is absolutely pouring into your body now. It's opening up your eyes so that you can see more clearly your life. It's opening up your ears so that you can spot opportunities and hear the answers that you've been looking for. It's opening up your mouth so that you can communicate and share your voice more authentically, more confidently. Keep taking that deep breath in and out while I'm talking. Keep pouring more white light into your body. Let it flow into your heart, opening up your heart. Let it flow down into your solar plexus, just under your ribs, helping wash away any, any feelings of not worthy, not good enough, not ready, not skilled enough, not pretty enough, any of that crap. <laughs> just picture it pouring through and sending light into all those areas. And then now focus again on that point in your body. Remember you located where you've been storing that emotion, where that blockage is, where that thing that's holding you back, where that emotion has been living in your body. Now use your breath and use the light 
to pour through the crown of your head and into that part of your body. Let it wash it all away. Use your breath to help you. Let it clear away, clear away, clear away, clear away. Picture it like a fireman's hose of water. That's how powerful this is. Imagine it completely power washing it away so there's not even a remnant of it left in your body or in your energy. Keep using your breath, keep bringing in even more light if you feel like it's still there. Sometimes when I do this, I literally feel a bit physically sick or I start coughing because it's like, oh, something's leaving my body. I'm getting rid of it now. There's no right or wrong way to feel. You can feel all kinds of ways as you're having this release. Keep using your breath. Keeping your eyes closed. Allowing that light to flow all the way through your body. That light is connecting all the way down now. It's grounding you into the earth as well. So the light is flowing in through the crown of your head, all the way through your body and grounding you to the earth so that you feel safe. You feel secure. You feel looked after. You feel the light of the universe taking care of you. You know that everything's going to be okay. Relax your muscles. Take another deep breath in. And again, one more deep breath in. Release. Amazing. When you're ready, you can open your eyes. And gently come back. So that's a fun little exercise to do at any time when you're feeling, I, I often do it when I feel like, oh, Woke up today feeling a bit overwhelmed, a bit anxious, a bit scared, a bit stuck, a bit frustrated. Just do that exercise. Pour in more and more and more and more light. Locate where in your body you're holding on to that low vibrational emotion, to that energy, and wash it out, wash it out, wash it out. Is anyone feeling a little bit better already? Is anyone feeling like they've let something go already? Or if you feel like you've actually just brought loads of stuff up to the surface, that's okay too. Keep taking deep breaths. Keep connecting to that light all throughout the day, all throughout the rest of your day, tomorrow. It's just a good habit to be in, to always just connect to that light and know that you are connected, safe, grounded, being filled at any moment that you want to with that bright white light.